Hello everyone, Immortal here. Today, let's dive into the basics of security. In cybersecurity, we'll discuss information gathering, or how to obtain information from all the targets, machines, or websites we will focus on. Now, we will use a tool called Mateo. If you're using Kali Linux like I am, this tool is already included. However, if you're using another OS, you will need to install it separately, like with Erat. For other operating systems, you have to install it first. It's the same process. You can also use it with Windows if you install it there. To find out where to download it, just search for it online. Alright, let's look at the security options we encounter, and decide whether it's enterprise or community. Okay friends, the mission of this video is to send an email and later download it. But in Kali Linux, it's already available. According to me, just handle it yourself, and we will start from the beginning. So, we start from the beginning here, and install the EXO. Let's see how long it takes to install. Don't wait too long, it should be done by now. Once it's installed, we need to activate it. We'll use the Community Edition, which is free and easy. We wait for a moment. For the first time, we need to log in. Click Next and enter the account we registered with. After downloading, we will be asked for other numbers. Later, this direction will be used in Mateo. Login might take a while if the internet is not very stable. Once logged in successfully, the display will look like this. How to use this has been discussed in previous tutorials, but we'll repeat it again so you remember it. Click New, and there will be a new display on the screen. On the far left, there are menu options, and there's a palette called Collective. We want to scan or gather information, select it here, then grab it here. For example, we want to name a website, just drag it. Now, it is here. It says trusted with 4eva.com, but this depends on the website we will target. For example, we want information from tangalden.com. Today, all information about tangalden.com will be searched, but we will not use it here, just use the advantage. If we want to search in the transport, for example, we want to search for technology. It says it was made with SSL web server, Ubuntu server, and if we click here, there is a review that can be seen. For you, just choose here, select, then click an alternative. Then press alternative for information on the current technology. If we want to search IP addresses and NS, let's see the output here. Oh, it turns out the IP is 3.13.21, which could be initial information or we could see email address or GPS. If we see the GPS location, where are they? It does not show. We see again email emails from the person. It can be used as information. Oh, the email doesn't mention it. No problem, we search again. For example, what is sensitive? Look at the information. It turns out it has eight numbers and uses Google Analytics. So we can see and identify the Google Analytics created with what? This can be done. For example, reset with similar or the same. Provide information on what to look for. Just click right or here, for example. If we want GPS, enter the longitude and latitude coordinates, then right click. Later we can choose. Or we want to search for a person's name. For example, Agus Gunawan. Gunawan Bakhtiar, we want to search for this person from the information, for example. We want to search for an email address from the name Gunawan. Just click. Then analysis will appear. Nothing, no email. Search what can be found. Just select. Here, the name Tegu Gunawan appears, found on YouTube, Facebook, Twitter, ST, etc., to find someone's data. You can see the names in use, Facebook, YouTube, etc. This is the basic usage. If you like this video and want to watch more content related to Linux cybersecurity or ethical hacking, please subscribe to the channel. Thank you so much for watching.